What's good, Spider Gang? MJ here, and today we're gonna be watching Mo Money. You guys have been requesting this one for quite some time. It's just been sitting on my list. It's a pretty short movie, so I don't know why I haven't got to it, but we're gonna be watching it today, and I'm excited. This one is starring one of the Waynes brothers, Damon Wayne. He was also in Blank Man, which is a reaction on my channel, so I know that this is probably gonna be funny and entertaining, so I'm excited. You know, it's early in the morning, and we getting the train going today. Anyways, if you guys end up enjoying my reaction to this movie or you want to see more movies like this, go ahead and like the video and subscribe to my channel so I know what you guys like. I already know what you guys like. So yeah, like the video. Also, if you want to see my full reaction to this movie and every other movie and show on my channel as well as get them early, go ahead and click that Patreon link down in the description below. Full movie and show reactions are there. And yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the movie. <laughs> Here we are watching Mo Money. I already love that it started with this music. This movie is uh, spicy, you know what I'm saying? It's a good way to wake me up because I am exhausted, y'all. When I tell you it is early oh. right now and I'm really tired. <laughs> we already know about a wife and kids production. I don't even know what this movie's about. I didn't even bother reading the description, so I don't even know what it's about. I love this song. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. If the movie's gonna be based on this song, I'm already loving it. Like, money can't buy you love. Marlon Wayans is in this too? I didn't know that. Asshole. The way they're driving, it looks like they wanna cut you off and kill you, bro. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, it was a setup. Yeah, I don't know who that guy was. It said executive producer on the side of his car, but it looks like them guys was definitely trying to kill you. I don't know why you thought they were just driving recklessly trying to kill somebody else. It doesn't even make sense, you know. He's still alive. <gasps> no, wait, will you get the tape, please? Oh, no, nah, these villains are a different kind of weird. Because that was low-key a good way to kill him because they would have just thought he broke his neck due to the car accident. No, this is wild. This is already wild. Let's move it! That guy's still breathing. L acting. He's still breathing. <laughs> There's Marlon. We we're, we're always happy to see Marlon for sure. What do you think I'm stupid or something? I can let you walk away with my 300 bucks. No way. I'm coming with you. So then what you complaining about? You fat sucker. Walk yourself up them stairs. It's cornbread. Open the door. Came to pick up the you know what, man. Please. Cornbread. Fat man need to lose some weight. Just open up. How do you know it's about you? Relax. That's Frank. Frank, how you doing that short for Frank Porter? <laughs> <laughs> Why is he always, he's literally always playing some weird character with a weird voice. Like, I'm sick of him. Look, I said I wanted a television, remember? You told me this, this piece of shit here. Hey, 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 don't treat him like that. You don't even know him. You gonna walk into his home and treat him like that? Disrespectful. Go yeah, go get it before I kick both your ass. Yeah, before I kick both eyes. Oh, oh, <laughs> he's so goofy. What if he's just acting? That'd be so funny. Well, can't that shit wait? Don't do that in front of me. Why you hungry? Here you go. It's a piece of chicken. Uh-uh, disrespectful. <laughs> this guy is like, how you gonna walk up into my home and then be disrespecting me in my home? Like, you got me messed up. Bro got a piece of chicken in his. I can't. Bro, why does it feel like they're acting? Oh no, yeah, they set him up for sure. They set him up for sure. That dude's gonna be gone. Oh my god, it's freaking hilarious. Yeah. I do it. Y'all are funny. Hey, y'all get up on money though. I guess that's what they're doing. They're scammers. They making money scamming, huh? Huh? Real nice. What's the matter? Two parts. Which one? Get it fixed. Oh, wow. <laughs> I've been having a lot of wisdom tooth pain, and if anything even touches that, I'm gonna die. Like. Good evening, officer. 
Keep moving, smart ass, or I'll take you in. That's, that's really not funny. How did you know that was an officer? How did he know? He literally said good evening, officer. Like, hey, get away from me, you fing bump. I'm a cop. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> Talk about, hey, wait a minute. Oh, crap. Why is a cop acting like he's a hobo? Like, that's a weird thing to be undercover as. Maybe he's trying to catch these two guys. Maybe they've been in more trouble than we know, you know? Damn. <laughs> Y'all suck. Ooh, juked you. <laughs> like, why are these... <laughs> these guys are so good at what they do. It's kind of embarrassing. <laughs> He's under the truck. Doesn't that hurt? Like, look at his back. <laughs> what the heck? So the other one just hit around a corner and didn't get caught, but this one could hide under a truck and they'll still be chasing him. <laughs> Why are they laughing at him? You think that's funny, bro? Ah, uh, shoot. Ted Forrest, white male, age 47, died at 1.13 a.m. What is he eating? Yeah, it is pretty insane. I mean, how do they get the jelly into these things? Huh? Really? With a syringe, bro. They just f***ing stick it in the butt and stick it in. Like, why are you worried about that? Get me that case, I'll deliver that myself. You wrap everything else a few things I gotta do. This lieutenant is so nonchalant. They's talking about jelly donuts. Sunday times. Like, seriously, what the heck? Hey, hey. <laughs> this is the holding cell. Why is he shitting in the holding cell? My mom talking about pressing charges on me. Man, I don't give a damn blam, Sam. Forget the peanut butter jelly. I'm ready to jam. <laughs> blam, blam, Sam. Peanut butter jelly. I'm ready to jam. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. <laughs> now, it is not okay what he's doing, but it is funny, though. <laughs> This dude's fat as hell. Hey, my man. Hey, you using that hat? You using that hat? So I better get this man something to wipe with. Give me a cigarette, boy. What? Why are you pressing me like that? Said I don't smoke. How is he supposed to give you a cigarette? He don't got a cigarette. Oh. Get out of there. <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> Hey, I don't think he's dead if he could beat you, but <laughs> yeah, I go lie, that was wild. I don't think you should have did that. If you find out about my probation, I could go away. Don't worry about it. I got you a lawyer. A lawyer? What's my name? Is he good? He's the best lawyer in town. That's not true. Why are you what? lying? Right, like. <laughs> Allow me to fumigate my wisdom on the defendant. He had been Is this a preacher? <laughs> On the issue of the cold thing. How can you even fight for this? I don't even know what you're saying. I said, if he been to the bowels of the community. He's very convincing, though. Oh, Mr. Stewart. The last time I saw you was, uh... Please don't remember. Please don't remember. The propaganda of the court structure. I'm going to have a sympathetic decapony on this case. Dismissed. Wait, what? Out of my court before I send you away. Wait, what? Could I get the Reverend Pimp Daddy to be my, my lawyer too, please? Uh, Reverend, my sister, she'll work it off the fee for you, man. So, soon she gets better. Bro, why, okay, if the judge said that the next time he sees him, he's putting him under the jail, why would you just let him off? Even if he was ill-represented, like any other reason, like he should be underneath the jail. Well, thanks for getting me out, Walsh. Me? You hungry? This is his boss? Well, I am. The monkey ain't no joke. I don't get what this guy is. Is he like an undercover cop or something? That wouldn't make sense because he's scamming people. What happened to the job I got you at Clucker Bucks? Walsh, they have me in a giant chicken costume. Mmm, seems like they, it seems like they want a lot more than they're getting. <laughs> I think that's the problem. They're not happy with what they're actually getting. It doesn't matter if you clean these shit houses. As long as it's an honest buck, you know what I mean? I ain't cleaning no shit. And then the, the longer you do it, the, the more you get promoted and you get paid more. Maybe a cop like my father. Come on, you don't have what it takes. What? Best damn cop there ever was. And he's dead, so what does that say about cops? Damn. That's, yeah, that's pretty brutal. But if he died doing his job, you know, died doing it, being a hero, I think that means something. 
I can tell you something about your old man. I can remember you sitting on steak. Okay. Probably heard this story so many times. Poor guy. It ain't gonna fall from the sky. You gotta work for what you want. You gotta work for what you want, and I, I think he's a. I think he's not telling the truth though. Don't don't list him when he tells you you don't have what it takes to be a cop. If you want to be a cop, do it. Like put in dedication because you can. Stop poke. Yeah, really? I like the lawyer. What the heck did he say? My concert. <laughs> Called him a crackhead, and then he did that. You just you just proved his point. So the computer makes a decision who gets credit and who doesn't. So that is the same guy. Okay, I couldn't tell because it was dark the first time we seen him, but I see now that he's the um the lieutenant. Another tough question. My nose is itchy. I lose my credit card. I don't. Also, guys, don't talk about me touching my hair, or biting my nails. I really don't care. Like it doesn't matter what I do. I could be perfect in a video, and you guys will still find something to talk about. So screw y'all. I don't care anymore. <laughs> Leave me alone. I heard about Mr. Forrest's death. I think it's a shame. Anything else I could do? No, well, thank you. Thank you for the English lesson. This dude's a butthole. Like, he's so proper. I would have been like, and, uh, you're fired. <laughs> Correct me again. <laughs> and you're fired. Bro, this house is a mess. This is your room? Jeez, dude. You're a grown man. Buy a book for your little bit. Yo, kid, why don't you tell your mommy about your book? Come on. Screw you. Oh, disrespectful. Reading is fundamental, ladies Look, and gentlemen. Johnny, the people don't care about their children's futures anymore. They really don't. I mean, that kid just said screw you, and that mom just let him say screw you. To understand and then learn and extend. Come and get paid. Here we go. We're gonna get What is he doing? How y'all gonna get paid? Cost. Here we go. Red card. Wow, you scamming. How much is this book? Oh, I knew I knew from the way that he looked at her that she was finna be fine. <laughs> he was like, "Geez." Besides, I think a kid'll like it. I don't have a kid. It's the eyes. It'll look just like you. Sweet taste and chocolate, good all the way through. Oh. You're fresh. I'll take my book before it melts. Thank you. Her voice. Okay, she may be pretty, but her voice is so sweet. Like it's such an innocent, gentle voice. Sure? Yeah, she wants the right card. <laughs> Did he just tell her? Hey! 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 Bro, he just lost his money like that. <laughs> now he's just there. Why are you <laughs> You're making him get robbed. You sure? Come on. <laughs> he mad cause he's he taking his money like dang. Gentlemen, so you just like gonna take the money and run? What? You just let her take the money and run too? What am I supposed to do now? Sell those books. Sell some books? Oh. <laughs> nah, he's messed up for that. He's really a, a, a asshole for that one. But I will say that is one piece of ass. Nah, so nah. I ain't gonna deny it. You know what I'm saying? Excuse me, Miss Amber. Think maybe we could get together for lunch? Seven for me, please. Can I'm we get busy. together? She really just she she kind of just played you low key. <laughs> I could see why he wanted to talk to her though. How my breakfast? Goody, goody. I mean, he really tried for you. I would give him a chance. Like. Water fountain's right over there. <laughs> he was really trying so hard. Oh, they hiring? Okay. That's the only one that's entry level. Fill this out. Oh, I believe there's room for everyone to succeed. Homeboy. <laughs> Ma'am, I would just not give her whatever job she's applying for just because of how she's acting right there. Are you serious? I have an eating disorder, you know. No. Threw up on the way over. I developed it from a negative self-image of a... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. It's not supposed to be funny, but the, the camera zoom in is so hilarious. I do not want to see her face like that. Some interesting responses here, uh, Mr. Stewart. Um... <laughs> the face jiggling is hilarious. He's like, <laughs> I appreciate it if you wouldn't mention my name to him. You certainly have personality. Bro, he wants to be a mailroom clerk. Is there really that many qualifications? Like, what, what is the worst he could do? Open mail? Get back to you in a couple of days. <laughs> Why is he doing that? Is your correct telephone number, isn't it? Yes, sir. Good. <laughs> he, can't, 
like it's it's funny because human nature makes you do that like you can't not do that like when someone's doing something in your face you have to copy it i know because i do it <laughs> what took you so long i think i might have got a job a job yeah a job johnny a job ain't nothing but work i know let's see well, don't don't be mad at him for getting a job stop it maybe you need a job <laughs> What the heck? This is so messed up. This is okay. If you really think about it though, this is actually really messed up because why are y'all sitting here messing up this man's store just to get some free food? Yeah, I mean, free lunch. Screw it. <laughs> I guess, you know, I'm not mad because it's free lunch. And I, I would love free lunch too if I could do that. But like I said, it is kind of messed up because these are people's livelihoods that y'all are messing with. But. Get you Wait, you? Off me, you bald -headed, flat oh, whoa, what's wrong with you? You see what you started? Come on, Harry. What, what are you doing? I'm up. Who the heck is this lady? <laughs> They're acting like she's known in there. It was inflicted after the fact. Now it's official. Oh. Mm hmm See, he knew it. He's a good lieutenant. People probably try to tell him otherwise. You heard with the phone I'm waiting on an important call. I put 25 cents in here. When it's used up, then I hate. 25 cents should not be that taken that long. I mean, like, 25 cents is only like what? 30 minutes on a payphone back then? I think. I don't know. Do you think they're gonna hire a convicted criminal into that company? I ain't John Gotti. Damn sure ain't. Oh, say so he ain't done nothing really bad. Like, all he did was scam. Disrespectful. The fact that he laughed with you is just the best part because I would have been like, he talking about the crust on my lip. See that cab over there? You're gonna steal a cab? No, man, you got you have to be waiting by the phone. Jesus Christ, this dude's gonna screw him up. I told you he called him like hey, you son of a bitch, I'll rip your freaking throat off. I mean, I doubt he will, but thank you very much. Yes, I got the job. Hey, yo, what? What is wrong with you? <laughs> if they actually kiss, bro, that's crazy. That's incest. <laughs> hey, I'm happy he got the job, though. Kudos to him. You know, maybe this will finally get him to clean his little act up and uh, make real money. Hi, Johnny, baby. That's Charlotte. I'll introduce you to your new machine. Ma'am, stop. Johnny Stewart, this is Keith Hedding. He's head of company security hey do you hear the one about the guy who goes to the psychiatrist oh god he's already annoying last night i was a wigwam the night before i was a teepee psychiatrist says relax you're too tense oh <laughs> that was the weakest joke in the world i didn't get it <laughs> you're too tense what are you doing for lunch uh working on who you are too close for comfort ma'am she's not ugly i don't know why he's looking at her like that maybe she's a little crazy but she's not ugly but she is way too close for comfort i would sm i would just flick her little nose <laughs> i don't have time for a scare chris you never said anything about anybody getting hurt or what the heck is going on 26 days 30 million dollars people are waiting on product is he one of the bad guys? I'm gonna assume. That was a dumb question, because I'm gonna assume he is from the way he's talking to this guy. <laughs> hey, give me those cards, okay? And them cards. I don't know what cards you're talking about, but you better give it to him. My number one guy. Shit. Terry, how are you? Now he just gets out and acts normal? That poor guy. You should cry, man. You constipated? You should try rocking back and forth. That's what I do. No, oh, dude, what you scaring me for? Oh, that's that one. That's it said T Stewart. That's that Tracy Stewart person. That's funny. Charlotte. Right. What do you do in this department? Don't sit on my desk. Why don't you want to talk to him? Like what? What's wrong with you? The 89 form. Finish with yes. Hey, what's that, Ember? What are you? Oh. I have this down to him a second, ma'am. You put aside those disputes as I requested. Jeez. What are you is such a, it feels like such a nasty question. What do you mean, what am I? I'm a human. I'll pass. Too bad. I think she likes you. I think I like you. Johnny! Jeez, man, can y'all stop cock blocking? Everybody keeps cock blocking, man. Can you just get this woman? He hasn't been feeling good. I know, he was constipated earlier. He was constipated earlier. He's gonna catch on for sure. He's not stupid. Hello, my weakness. 
My weakness. Oh, is someone calling my weakness like butterflies? Can I get down on one knee? I don't think my boyfriend would like that. Boyfriend. Oh, wow. That's how it is. I love your smile. You got a beautiful smile. Yeah. Amber, let's go. That's her boyfriend. It's your boss friend. He treats you like you ought to be treated. No, I know he don't. He sounds like he don't know how to treat a woman. Damn, I got to get my shit together. Yeah, you do. This guy is a butthole. Why is she even with him? You really shouldn't waste your time talking to street trash, Amber. What is that supposed to mean? He's beneath you. He's beneath you. Like, this guy is disrespectful. Don't talk to him. She's going to talk to him anyways. I bet you she is. Hey man, he doing his job though. Why he always gotta wear a hat? Like, is he insecure about his bald head? I think it's beautiful. Free, baby. Oh my God. <laughs> Ma'am. <laughs> he can't even do his job, right? And he trying to get his stuff together. Around. He thought it was her. Turn back around so quick. Hey man, that guy, he's hes a hard worker. We know that. That's kind of, you know, that's something we always knew even when he was scamming. He was hard working at scamming, you know? But I feel like he just didn't want to work a regular job because he had no motivation, no push. But now he does because he wants to get with this chick. Things you want to do have no culture. Trying to open up your mind to something other than rap music. Oh, bro. Opera? Opera is crazy, though. <laughs> Yo, that's a man. Yo, he's filthy, G. <laughs> <laughs> She's trying so hard not to laugh. Look at her. She's trying so hard not to laugh. <laughs> Keith Henning told me that joke. <laughs> <laughs> She's trying so hard not to laugh, man. Remember, it's not that funny. What are you laughing at? Uh oh. I guess it's time for fun and games with the male boy. Come on, kick his ass. I'm about to say, you really think that he's not gonna beat you up, bro? Here, why don't you get yourself a decent meal, boy? Thanks. <laughs> Talking about thanks. How was I supposed to react? Not by treating me like a whore. Yeah, that 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 was disrespectful, though. He can't afford you anyways. Like, what does that mean? That's so disrespectful. If she, especially if she's not a gold digger. Damn! I should have broke that boy's back. Yeah, you real. I would have. I would have broke his back if I were you. What am I supposed to do? He's a top level executive. I'd have lost my job, but you would have still had your faith. True. That's very true. The ego, pride, and faith would have still been there. <laughs> $2 shirt and a $3 tie. Just a $12 outfit and a bottle cap for a hat. Wait, that was horrible math, bro. <laughs> he said $12 outfit. At least he's counting the hat. Sorry, she ain't nothing but a money hungry hoe. Why the hell you think her eyes are. What you just call her? Don't call her that. That's so disrespectful. You see, this is a problem with, with not just guys, but, but people in general. When you're trying to get your friend to get over someone, you talk shit about that person. Like, it's going to be like, yeah, you're right. They are a hoe. And then get over it. Like, no, it doesn't work that way. You shouldn't do that because it's just going to upset them. Like, they don't view that person that way, you know? Bro, what are you doing? He's been watching you all this time. Okay, I guess he's not watching him today. He somehow got one. I want to thank you very much for helping me with the investigation. Let me know if I can be of any more help. You're talking straight to the bad guy. Yeah, just a few questions. About what? He got a job. Look at that. How do you like this office? Oh. Why does it keep watching him? I don't like that. He just asked me a bunch of questions about the mail room. Okay, they're shutting down. What did you say? Nothing. I played dumb. Why would you say nothing? You could have just been like, oh yeah, he's the security director. That's all he is, you know? Like, that's all I know him as. <laughs> this poor guy. Like, it's always the innocent worker, hard workers that be getting dragged into nonsense and then probably they're gonna get in trouble for being the accomplice because they didn't speak up. Like, that's just not fair. I mean, there are diseases out there. It's a psychological thing. Bro, that nose is wild. <laughs> They're talking about diseases in bed. I'm more concerned about his nose. See, let me see it. Would you stop it? You act like a little mosquito in my ear. You didn't say that last night, now did you? Oh. How much is something like this? Well, that ring, sir, is three. Jeez. Like it. I love it. 
Oh, nah, he. Sometimes I feel like a nut, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I feel like slapping the shit out of you, and right now I do. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry. I was confused for a second. What am I supposed to do? Run out the store every time I open my mouth? Damn. Uh, uh. D I C K expires whenever. Huh? Gentlemen, enjoy your ring. So nasty. I would have just let him go too. That's so disgusting. I thought a lot though. He almost he was dissing bro for, for selling him for a piece of ass, but then continue to do it with another girl. Yeah. So you better get that girl a mood ring or something. A mood ring? It's a jacket. And a hat. No, and a shirt. Sir, no, don't do that. I'm gonna get you one thing. You wanted a leather jacket, you're getting a leather jacket. I need a break. I need a break. Hey man, they look clean though. Check it, check it out. Bro, you're gonna get in so much trouble. Oh my gosh, you're gonna get in so much trouble. If they find out you've been using this freaking credit card, you could literally get arrested for this, like for real. That's not even him. He's mocking him, isn't he? It doesn't sound like him at all. I've got a joke for you. What does a man with a one <laughs> baby food and therapy? Lots of it. Keith Hedding told me that joke. <laughs> I'm dead. I knew it was it. I knew it was it from the beginning because that voice is so funny. So what do you want? I brought you something. Following him is crazy. Where is it? Oh. Oh, he just went straight into the action. I'm feeling it. You know what I mean? I'm happy that he like went for what he wanted and stuff, but like, I don't think that was a good way to do it. Huh. You know what I mean? This dude is running for his life. That music is beautiful. Dang, he missed his train. Shoot. Uh-uh. It's too quiet. He's by himself and it's too quiet. Someone's gonna try to kill him. Is that a pizza? That pizza look crazy. It look like it's packed with pepperoni. Oh, dang, I can't even eat my pizza! <laughs> Dude, it's not even blood all over him. It's just pizza. Damn, bro got mugged, mugged. <gasps> and then they stabbed him and threw him in the train. Wow. Five Italian suits from Elite Wear. Flight limousine service. Dinner at Lou Chow's. I mean, you thought you weren't gonna get caught? Like, they literally, they have every record of every transaction with every credit card, like. <laughs> hey, that looks just like you. Damn. See, I hate to check that, Johnny boy. Yeah, that is a federal offense. <laughs> no, I hired you. Do my affirmative action bit. Hmm. Is he finally gonna let him in on his little uh his little scam schemes, whatever the heck he got going on? If I don't, you go to jail. I mean he's giving you an opportunity to not go to jail. You know, he's not gonna call the cops. What y'all standing around for? You look like somebody died in here. Someone did die in here. As you all know, due to a very unfortunate episode last night, Chris is no longer with us. Unfortunate episode? That's how you address it? Jonathan Stewart will be Chris's replacement as mailroom supervisor. What? See, that's how you know it's even worse. That's how you know he's set up though, because he just got the job here. Everyone else has been working just as long and probably harder than he has. Yo, do you know how much shit is out there that we didn't get yet? Yo. What is see this dude don't he don't he don't understand like this is his job he could literally go to jail like yo we could get paid it's not like they're gonna find out we go we get paid we do this they did find out i will say they already find out like but just leave it alone it's over okay it's over so i guess you don't want to hear about the mink sock no he don't marla looks so young here oh my gosh i just realized he looks like a literal little kid but yeah no you can't do that he's against my printout and the funny thing is everyone of my deceased mm. dead people shot oh crap he gonna catch you clerk must have got into the system ain't that something 
Yeah, he 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 knows he knows for sure that it's him. He could tell. There's just no way, cause like all of them are dead. All of a sudden, Chris is dead, but you're putting the blame on him. Hmm. We got some shopping to do. I thought you said all I had to do was get you the card. Johnny, I lie a lot. What happened to the girl? I thought that was the whole main point of this. Well, now we're in, in Johnny's villain arc, or like not his villain arc, but he's getting blackmailed by a villain. Like. I like that hat. Kiss my ass. Kiss my ass. You all are not friends. I think it's weird is the movie's almost over. Like, <laughs> it's literally like only 20 some minutes left. What's gonna happen in these last 20 minutes? Get some clothes too, yeah? In the big time now, charge it. Hey man, I suggest you, uh, I suggest you do what he says. He seems like the top guy. He hasn't gotten caught after all this time, so. If you fuck me, I'll kill you. Again, I hate when people say it like that. Like, why couldn't he add, like, why is it so hard for him to say, if you fuck with me? Why does he say, if you fuck me? What does that mean? Gay. Hey man, he making real money dealing with him. I ain't complaining. Oh, he got another girl. <laughs> she probably like him. Oh, it's so I just love I just really love how he did this just for this girl, to be honest, but got us some bullshit now. Do not want no spam ham. The bald head is crazy. <laughs> OK, I see why he keeps a hat on now. <laughs> I'm sorry. It just looked funny when they were going close to each other like that. Whoa, they're getting freaky back there. I couldn't see it. It wasn't very clear, but that's what it looked like. <laughs> Bro, finally got his tooth removed. <laughs> stupid girl and that stupid job. Johnny, we don't hang out anymore. What are you talking about? I just took out to the dentist. I will say, do you care though? Look at what you're wearing. I don't understand. First you were complaining about y'all getting money and him getting a job, but now you're complaining about him not spending time with you while he's making money for y'all. Like, I don't get it. Mm. What? What happened? I got my tooth pulled. Oh, poor baby. Now she flirting with him too, though. Uh-uh. <laughs> Stop. Simo, we're going out dancing. You want to come? Be a sick she made him ask him, though. To look just like her. Wait, let me get dressed. <laughs> Wait, let me get dressed. That bitch like a burnt french fry. Are you sure these two? So it's like a bridge, bridge, man. <laughs> I can't. Uh, these guys are with me. Uh, this girl is a runaway. Been following me all night. <laughs> been following me all night. <laughs> oh my god. It's okay. I love the comedy in the relationship, but it's just so cute. Like. Hurry up. This is my jam. So is my jam, man. We just got here. Relax. <laughs> we got all night. This is a hectic party. I can't even see what's going on. She's like, what the hell? Hey, you never know. You could like her. She could be like a freak freak. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I don't know why he's dissing her. I, I think Charlotte, I don't know why they're, they're, they're trying to depict her as ugly. I think Charlotte's pretty. I, I do. Even like burnt french fries is just wild to me. You know what I'm saying? But I think she still look pretty cute. I just think she crazy. He's like, hmm? Why is someone calling him? Why am I in this damn thing? She don't look that bad. Why is he grabbing all these people's drinks? What if what what if there was like a creepy guy who drugged one of these drinks? Are they about to make out? <laughs> I thought they were gonna make out out of nowhere. Like, why don't you give her a chance? Just just dance with her a little bit, dang. Oh, and then the slow dance. I love it. I love this club. I love it. Oh, so sweet. Hey, yo. Where y'all just come from? Come on, man. It's not funny. She good people, man. I ain't drunk in Casanova. <laughs> drunk in Casanova. Talk about she good people now all of a sudden, huh? I'm gonna rock your world. I heard. Hey. 
Hey, yo. <laughs> hey, man, there's always someone for someone out there, you know what I'm saying? I, st I still think it's kind of crazy how she just left her man that fast just for him. No, the money, Johnny. Where did you get that from? I hit the lottery. Don't lie to her. Please tell me it's not drugs. It's not drugs. I'm serious. I'm serious too. I mean, I'd be ready to chase tell them the truth. It's not drugs. I want to give you the things you want. I have everything I want. Don't throw that away, okay? I guess he kind of listened to dude a little too much when he said that, you know, he can't afford her. So he's thinking that she really wants everything materialistic. Like she wants everything to buy. But I don't think, I don't think you should ever, at least don't treat a girl like that at first. If she acts like that, that's different. But don't treat her like that at first. Oh! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Wow, really? Two dollars. <laughs> Two dollars? Catch the train. <laughs> You're a shitty person, you know that? Well, well, well. You better not. What we got here. You better not. Go ahead and learn how to knock on the door, but that's cool. What's up? What's up? What are you scared of? Nothing. I got you the promotion. Yeah, but he didn't really want that. Let's just say I know when to throw in my cards. I guess I was wrong about you, Johnny. Yep, I guess so. Now he's gonna have to kill you. Yep. It sucks that you're gonna have to kill him. Dude, are you serious? Uh uh. This looks like a repeat of the beginning when the other dude got caught. So it's looking like you. Ooh, ouch. It's looking like you're gonna get caught though. I am fat, fat. Oh, gotcha. Damn. Maybe shoving my foot up his big ass, that'll get it out of him. I know you're so tough with these cuffs on. Take the cuffs off and see how tough you are. I mean, I was gonna say, he's still gonna be just as tough. A white guy. What's his name? I don't know. They all look alike. Smell like baloney. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard someone say that a white guy smells like baloney. That's crazy. All right, I know this guy. I know the dude. This dude. His name is Keith. Keep it. Keep, keep it. <gasps> I hope he didn't actually tell on bro. 25G. And there's no risk involved for you. I don't know what you're talking about. Dude, uh, he's screwing up so bad. You shouldn't even be trying to get in this business. How about I try to set you up? Don't you think the cops would be here right now with their guns out? In the oh, yeah, you're done. They tapped you. Well, that's great. No, thank you, Sergeant. I think you've done enough. Dang. And then he turned that music on loud so they couldn't hear what he was talking about so they can't convict him. Damn. Fine, so you need evidence, and that's in the system, and I can get that for you. No, I don't want you involved. I am involved. I am about to say she had. Like, you literally, you told her about it and did it for her, so she's definitely involved. Oh, Johnny. It wasn't him. They changed my access code. Johnny! Seymour. Why did she yell like he was right behind him? I thought bro was in the room with them. He's on the camera. <laughs> Ooh! Wow, you fell for that? You kind of goofy. Oh, <laughs> he slapped the door in bro's face. That is the sickest way I've ever seen someone knock someone out. That is hilarious. <laughs> Are we having fun? At least he came back for his homie, you know. Oh. Like, I don't understand. Why are you shooting downwards and he's behind the thing? Come on, let's go. What about the tape? Forget it, we got dead bodies. Freaking, we got dead bodies. I don't know if they're dead, but yeah, you, you definitely caused a scene. By now you'd have your shit together. Obviously you don't. Damn. What the fuck you doing? What are you waiting for? Hey man, I think he'll make, I don't know what this dude's talking about. I think he'll make a hell of a cop. Like he's good at getting down to the, the crack of things. He's, he's, I don't know. Like, I guess I view it different. fell out the back of the car you are crazy. it's so many things that are so small and happening that should not be happening <laughs> like why did he keep why didn't that guy in the back of the van just jump out why did he stay there and fall out don't make sense at least he ain't killed the lady because that would have been jacked up you took her cans which is even more messed up but you know <laughs> 
y'all are both of y'all are so jacked up because you could have just went around them i'm so confused whoa straight into a, a car shop is <gasps> i really hoped he ducked yeah i was gonna say that would literally kill him so bad Oh shit. Bad timing, bro. I do not need to like I really don't need to fight you right now. <laughs> Kick them in the balls again. You, just the home base. I got a situation here. you don't even know what the situation is. Y'all always just got a situation. How are you gonna jump off? Like that train is moving really fast, dude. I don't think you could just jump off. I mean, if the cops get him now, he can't get in trouble because he technically didn't do anything. He was he was blackmailed and stuff. So, well, he didn't. No, false. He did steal credit cards. He did do that. So, he'll get in trouble for that. And you're gonna join him. Oh, Ooh. <laughs> he's like, you're gonna join him, that dude. Be doing this on top of a car. I don't even know how he's holding on. Like. Pretty good driver, don't you think? I'm, I'm a pretty good driver. No, you're not. You're crashing into everything. At least you gave him a soft landing. Thank you. <laughs> okay, uh, I think the car may, may be stalling because there's just no way that, oh, I will say there's just no way that he's not catching up to him in a car, but. Oh, I thought he was dead. Look at me. Look at all that gravel in the blood spot. Dummy ran out of bullets. Did he shoot him once or twice? I think the second one was a warning shot if I'm not mistaken, but he shot him the first time. So This is literally like it, this isn't even meant to be an action movie for real But this is literally like every fight scene in every movie right here. They're both bloody and injured and, and just throwing punches Jesus Good headbutt He definitely oh. fucked you real good. Why are you gay? Oh God. Oh God. Uh, no, there's no way that's how he goes, right? Oh my God. That is such a bad way to go. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. Johnny Stewart. 332 down the hall until you're right now. Get out of my face. You should have answered it correctly the first time, ma'am. Yes. Oh, but you yes the next person, huh? People are so rude. Damn, that person just died. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Why you keep stealing flowers? I'm interrupting something? No, six toe. Six toe. <laughs> Instead of saying third wheel, six toe. To the dynasty club. We could get paid for workman's constipation. Look, no more scams. I mean, that's not really a scam. You can't sue them. My name. Is she cool? Say more. <laughs> hey, that's karma for the lawyer thing. Remember when he's what's my name? <laughs> Got you. No. Where were we? Mo money, mo hey, yeah. <laughs> mo money, mo money, mo money. <laughs> it was definitely funny. I'll give it that. It was definitely funny. I hope I wasn't talking too much because I want you guys to see as much as well. I hope I was talking too much because I want you guys to see as much as possible. There was a lot of parts that I thought was executed well, but there was also a lot of parts that I thought were really amateur. But you know what? I don't care. It was still an entertaining movie. That's what it's meant to be. So nine out of the eight out of ten. We're gonna smack it on there. Eight out of ten. That's pretty much all I have to say. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for tuning in. This has been MJ and don't ask about Spider-Man. Peace.